Hi. Hi there. Hello. How are you? I hope you're having an absolutely amazing day so far. Today is going, it kind of took a left turn right off the bat because I took the wrong size dab for the wrong time of the day. I should have taken just a little tiny one and I just, I ripped a big old glass. So it's been a fairly unproductive morning, but I have the weed box. We are going to unbox this and check out everything that it came with. Sesh through the piece. This is not a subscription box. How it works is you just go onto the website and you figure out what box it is that you want. It's not a surprise. You can see everything that comes in the box and the price. They even have it like line listed there. You sometimes can choose the color of the pieces. You can also choose some other little modifications. I'm getting ahead of myself. They have everything you need except the green within this box. Let's let's finish off that dab real quick. I think the problem was that I went and I stayed at a tree house. I'm going to show you some pictures of it or some video of it. It was so damn cool. So I stayed at a tree house over the weekend, um, but you weren't allowed to smoke any wheat and I didn't want to bring anything that smelled like super duper dank. I did bring dry herb vapes, but that smell goes away relatively quick. And of course I brought like a vape and edibles and I could have probably brought the dab ring, but I did it. So I didn't have dabs for like two days and it was kind of a little, it was weird. I love dabs too much. That was too little. You might hear some talking in the background. My cleaning lady is here and I'm not about to tell her to be quiet because she's doing me the world's most massive favor. Of course I pay her, but still like somebody coming over here to clean my house is, is the best thing that could ever happen for me. Um, it saves me eight hours a week, which I'll be completely honest, I wouldn't spend eight hours a week cleaning my own house anyway. She doesn't even come every week, but every other week I'm kind of forced to like pick up um, everything around the house. So it kind of keeps everything cleaned and organized. I get all my bongs clean before she comes. It's probably one of my best life hacks is to have a cleaning person, just a cleaning company, a cleaning person. I always go with an independent cleaning person. I've never had any luck with a cleaning company, nor do I, no, no offense if you own a cleaning company, but I don't want to give them my business when I know I could give the business directly to somebody. Cheers. Oh no, my battery's gonna die. Okay, I'm super excited you're back. I have to fix my chair though. Um, I use this as a cushion. It's a shawl. I'm not an office chic kind of a lady, but I got this in a subscription box and my chair has no padding. What's up? That's what I'm sitting on. So because this was a piece of fabric, um, that I wasn't going to use. I just fold it into a, um, a little cushion. And with that, I have like about a half of an inch of cushion. Okay, so let's break into the weed box. This is the February box. It's only $39 and you can use code hi there to save 10% off of your very own box. Always check the pinned comment. You'll find all the information you need for anything that you see in a video. So if you want to hang out with me on Instagram, it's all down in the pinned comment. This gets shipped to you lickety split. So if you order it, it gets shipped like next business day and you get it in like three to four days depending how far you are from California, but pretty solid, fast shipping. It always comes with a Kush card that you can scratch to get a percentage off. Guesses anybody? <laughs> It's a 10% off. I've never been lucky enough to get anything more than 10% off. But you could also use it on just the glass. You could use my code, hi there, on just the glass as well. We have how to win a free box by posting and tagging them on socials. A weed box slap, is that what people call this? <laughs> that makes sense. So we got two little bundles in here. This will be all of our accessory extra items. And then this piece will be the glass. It's a surprise to me because they send this box my way and I truly thank the Weed Box for doing that. It's the best. <laughs> it's amazing. My life, I take, I do not take it for granted at all. I appreciate each and every one of you so damn much. Um, I, I need you to know that this is, I do not take this for granted. This is the best 
ever. <laughs> That's the first thing we're gonna get into. If you wouldn't mind, please like the video, hit subscribe before you leave. I'm here for you twice a week, sometimes even three times a week, but I'm not gonna hold myself to that. Painted my nails purple. I was gonna put little pink hearts on them, but they're already chipping, so it kind of seems silly to decorate them, but look at how cute they are with these cones. These are King Palm Skywalker colored cones. I've literally, I've never seen these before. I've never tried anything um, from King Palm that's not one of these, like one of their King Palm leaf rolls. I'm not much of a paper girly, but I'm real intrigued by this. We're gonna open these up real quick. Oh my God, they even have matching stabby sticks. <laughs> this is so cute for spring. This is so cute for Valentine's Day, just these two. <gasps> Look at it. I'm not even a paper girly, but I always keep like a pack or two around. You never know like who's gonna come over to your house and maybe it's something that they prefer. Here is just, a, it's a standard black clipper lighter. These ones are uh, refillable, reflintable. You just yoink this out, but it'll probably chip my nail polish. So I'm not gonna do that. Um, and yeah, solid, it's a solid lighter. I almost burned myself. It's a solid lighter. Oh, the other King Palm thing was a dual pack. So there's two flavors. You get to try two of them, the, uh, the Pine Drip and the Watermelon Wave. And then you always get a pair of Huff socks. You can also choose to like trade out the socks for more cones or wraps or papers or something like that. There's a drop down menu when you check out that gives you options. You can also gift wrap it if you'd like. I'm curious what they're gonna do for 420. I'm curious what all of the brands are gonna do for 420 and I think we're gonna find out pretty quick because it's really only like eight, eight and a half weeks out as well. Shipping for most 420 related things actually starts April 1st, which is like six weeks out. That's exciting. The last thing that we have in here is the peas we get the smoke out of. I have my, my air filter behind my bed um, so that I can turn that on basically immediately. I don't think Yulia smokes. She doesn't mind that I do, but I don't really want to smoke her out of my house. Is that rude? Does that feel rude? No, maybe not. I don't think she cares and it is my house. Um, here's the piece. <laughs> you will never get a broken piece from the weed box. There's so much bubble wrap. I hope you have things that you want to ship because you have a lot of really good bubble wrap and a solid box to ship it in if you don't mind that it says the weed box and has pot leaves all over it. That is such a cute box. I love this upgrade. I think they also send it in that brown shipping box. I'll put it on the screen if they do. Um, to make sure that it's discreet for you, of, of course. I think that there's a matching bowl, which is wild because um, matching bowls, for some reason, are a rarity. They should be commonplace. They should be the standard because who wouldn't want like a donut bowl for their donut piece? Here's a little sneak peek. Here is the bowl. It has this really wide surface for pulling up. I wonder if this will be like a little catch tray when filling it or a nice little area to put out a hemp wick. Okay, the bowl is nice, but like the piece is gorgeous. This is such a weird looking design. I love it. You're really far away. It seems like you're so, ooh, it whistles. <laughs> Once we put water and weed in it, I don't think it's going to whistle anymore, but um, it has a downstem with the slots all on the bottom. I appreciate that, can you see it? The slots are aiming downward. That way you don't have to fill it up to here with water because that's a lot of water. If you want to, you still could. It's just that you don't have to. You only have to fill it up to like the tip of the joint there. Let's put water in it. It's so loud. This is really dry. I wish there was a hack that if your weed was dry, you could spray it with water. <laughs> I was looking for my hemp wick. It is right there. This is, this seems like an, uh, a cute little matchup. This thing is called Bong Buds. It's just a strip of fabric and it's got tiny little magnets in it and the magnets are like super strong. Um, and they hold onto your lighter to your bong. You like wrap it around the neck of it. Um, if it's like any size bong, it's just, it fits all of the bongs, <laughs> but it holds on to your clipper. What a cute little combo is that? I'm gonna mess it up. Well, not mess it up because I love these colors together also. Oh my God, I'm so shaky. All right, thanks for hanging out with me. Let's smoke this bowl real quick. Oh my God. I wonder why I have these little tiny short hairs at the front of my head um, from doing shit like that. That was so pretty. It's 
so dry though. Oh, thank God I smoked that in a bong. It needs to be a dryer vape. I really like how that chamber fills up. One more time, I think we got one more. Okay, I lied, but I feel like we can get, I feel like we got one more. Down, deep down in there. I should have cornered the bowl. Wasn't that so pretty? I forgot to show you, they had it etched. So it tells ya, it's from the weed box down here. Is that etched in there? I think it is. That was fun. I need to turn on that filter real quick. You guys don't mind, right? I'm gonna crank it and light a candle and, and uh, is that a weed nug on my bed? <laughs> Look at this tiny little baby nugget. I just found on my bed, like on my sheets. Why, I, I made the bed. I found a full size nug in a sweater pocket the other day. Who in the world puts a nug in their pocket? I don't recall doing it. I'm gonna clean up so that it doesn't smell. Oh yeah, I was gonna light that candle. I'll be honest, I hate the smell of lavender, but up here in the bedroom we have the, uh, the candle and the spray and I have the winter green down downstairs which I don't want to open the door and that like allows too much of the smell to escape I'm gonna keep it contained <laughs> it would help if I sealed the package of a weed <laughs> and closed the dab jar I was just recording and talking to myself for like 10 minutes. What was I, where was I? Oh, she's clean. There we go, look at that. So beautiful, sparkling clean again. Um, it has like a little dip up here. I don't know what you would do with that. Display a little nug. It's just, it's kind of cute. It kind of gives to, oh, I bet you it's more for the internal function. I thought that the function was excellent. It did the best it could for that dry ass weed, especially at the size of it. You could use it as a little dab rig and it has a nice solid wide around base so you're not gonna knock it over. That's a beautiful little smoke out glass. I wonder if it came in other colors. That's a pretty one. It doesn't look like anything else that I have. It probably doesn't look like anything else that you have. So things that are uniquely different, conversation starters, those are my favorites. The February box comes with this piece until it sells out. I will have all the information again in the pinned comment. A two pack of the King Palms, two different flavors. I didn't even tell you, they're, they're the king size. They hold two grams. But then we also have their color cones in like such a cute space springtime eastery semi valentines -y, um type of color scheme the socks and a clipper lighter that was a salad box that was fun thanks for hanging out thanks for sessioning along thanks for um getting chatty with me i have all the information down in the pinned comment you all are the absolute best please consider hitting subscribe before you leave leaving a like a comment subscribing it all is immensely helpful i truly appreciate it also a huge shout out to all of my patrons for making videos like this possible you'll see all their sweet ass names over here and to the weed box for sending this box my way. I love you all so damn much. I'll see you next time. Bye. I am so hungry right now and she's cleaning in the kitchen, which means I'm going to end up resorting to the nut mix that I have in my snack drawer that I need to replenish. Okay, quick update. I had much better snacks in my stoner drawer than I thought that I did. I have the Brock's Conversation Hearts. I cannot tell if they're mint or if they're fruit flavored. My kids say they're only mint. I'm tasting fruit. Oh wait, there's flavors on the package. Purple is obviously grape. Red is cherry. Yeah, they're obviously different. And Milk Duds, another solid choice. Have a great night.